Hi there! This is just to show how I manually optimize a 3D model from a high poly model. We do this to eliminate extra polygons to lower the poly count of each model but still retain the model's shape and look. I will only be showing a part of the model I'm optimizing. As you can see in wireframe mode, the yellow parts have more edges or polygons than the gray parts because the gray parts are already optimized. I will be working on just a small part at the bottom of this star. Select and then isolate. There are four elements here that looks alike and I will be working on those parts. Select just one element from the four and then detach it from the whole object. Exit isolation mode and then select the detached part and isolate again. We can now start optimizing. The two bars sticking out has less edge loops than the bottom and I'd like to add just one edge loop on both ends at the top part. I make sure to leave at least one edge loop beside the ends of the object to retain its shape even when applied with a turbo smooth modifier like so. If not, the ends would look pointed and not squared as I will show here when I delete those edges that I just added. I will now be selecting edge loops that can be deleted but will still retain its original shape. I selected these edge loops to delete and retain the ones that are beside the ends of this part to maintain its shape. Moving on to this part, I would be selecting the edges alternately to test it out but still keeping in mind that the shape must be retained. I left the edge loops at the ends as I did earlier and I will test out the turbo smooth and it still retains its shape but there could still be some edge loops that can be deleted. I always check in Turbo Smooth if it retains its shape even after I deleted those edges. Now I'm checking if everything is okay. The edge loops at the ends are there. Even at the bottom parts, I have edge loops and at the top. So when in Turbo Smooth, everything is in order. Now to duplicate this part. Selecting again at the bottom part of the car. I would be assigning a gray material just to show that I'm done with this. And then duplicating this part on the other side. Making sure that it's aligned on the original one I would delete this part to give way to the edited version of it and now delete turbo smooth modifier and using a symmetry we will now have the duplicates of it on the other side and choosing again the originals and deleting it we now have four parts that are optimized I hope you enjoyed and learned something from this short video this is from the artist society thank you for watching